Mm -hmm. And guess who's back? Barry Moss is on It's Barry Moss every social media platform for Why in the Morning for Queen's Wednesday and representing for the Kings on this particular Queen's Wednesday. So remember, uh, we are on social media as always. They're always right there below the screen. And before I introduce the segment and the name of my guests, I'd like to send a major shout out to uh, Oguda Kayesu and Callum Ival for always starting our Wednesdays on a laughing note with those breaking uh, views. Uh, so if you happen to interact with videos that might break the views, uh, send them our way on our social media handles. And I'll say it again right there below the screen. So uh, we have some people ready on our uh, Facebook the were uh, huh were sending their comments our way and uh, we really 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 appreciate that so keep them coming so we can sample them towards the end of the show right there so yes it's time for strength of a woman and uh, my strength of a woman of the day goes by the name Carol uh, Samuel and she's a consumer specialist Carol San. Thank you. Uh -huh. Your camera is number four. Right. And uh, I've, I've been looking forward to this for some reason. Because uh, this title right here, uh, I think it's the first time I'm interacting with it. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, so your camera is number four. You can introduce yourself if I missed anything. Uh, credential Zako Pale. Uh, I'll give you a chance and so then we can carry on. Um, my name is Carol Mbula Samuel. Uh, I'm a custo uh, I'll take care of the um, customer, I'll mm -hmm. say that. Uh -huh. But uh, majorly, my title is key account manager. Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm also in sales and marketing mm -hmm. and um, a customer service professional. Mm -hmm. In this, I mean, it's just uh, basically in the sales process, mm -hmm. they will interact with the customer right from the mm -hmm. time they buy their product, mm -hmm. have a delivery point. Mm -hmm. You make sure that the process is seamless. Mm -hmm. You take through the customer the entire process of the sales. Mm -hmm. uh, until they buy the product from you, mm -hmm. even do after sales uh, uh, follow ups uh -huh. and make sure that the entire process is seamless. That's right. what I do. So, customer service specialist. Yes. Is your title. And you had to uh, do a lot to get to this point, uh, but we are going to get to that. So, uh, I'd like to know in this line of work, customer service uh, professional, as a customer service professional, uh, is it uh, industry specific or a customer service? The uh, professional can 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 work can cut across industries. Uh, I work for Kanjendro, uh -huh. so that means I take care of the uh, Kanjendro customers. Mm -hmm. um, my work basically is um, uh, majorly the the what I'm measured in mm -hmm. is on the key accounts, uh -huh. but uh, it doesn't mean that you ignore the other uh, general customers. You uh -huh. have to serve any customer that work, uh -huh. works in the showroom. But obviously, this is the, the, <laughs> there has to be the key accounts. Correct. Uh, even low firms have the, the biggest clients with the biggest. Uh, right from uh -huh. our consumer uh, products, that uh -huh. is the TVS, the border border. Uh -huh up to the customer who is buying the equipment, uh -huh. that the do some equipment. Uh -huh. So you must have all the customers with what we call core values. I mean, uh -huh. Every customer has to be treated right, uh -huh. regardless of that you're buying a border border for months or uh -huh. the concept is the same. All right, yes. so when I walk into, say, uh, Can General, and uh, I get uh, excellent service, these things are all premeditated. It doesn't happen by chance. These things are all planned. Uh, well, we, as an organization, we live by the core values. Uh -huh. That is um, our key value. Even when you work at the reception, you will see that it's a sign written, uh -huh. making customers smile. Uh -huh. So once you walk in the showroom, you have to walk the talk. Uh -huh. Right from uh, the cleaner, right from the person who sells, uh -huh. right from the, even the boss. Uh -huh. So our core values have put us in a way that once you come in the, in the showroom or you're having a presentation from a client a point of view, uh -huh. you emphasize on their core values, that making customers smile and for me to take quality. Uh -huh. I mean, we, we have a fr franchise of consumer products uh -huh. That is uh, both, both on TVS and mm -hmm. that is the two wheelers mm -hmm. and also the Piaggio, which is the three wheeler. They normally call the top two. Mm -hmm. That's right. what is known in the market. In a scale of one to ten, yes. uh, how much do you think you love cars? Um, or know about cars? <laughs> I'll say eight. Eight? Yes, I do. All right. Did you always <laughs> know and love cars uh, or it happened when you interacted with this job? Um, uh, once I joined as a management trainee, that was uh, way back in 20, 2010, uh -huh. um, the knowledge that we were being given uh, uh -huh. usually was on um, just on accounting, uh -huh. but 
I found my way to the sales function uh -huh. where where you find the automotive that where the customer is. Mm -hmm. I found that will be you know that function that means bring mm -hmm. revenue to the company. That's what I wanted to be associated with right mm -hmm. from the beginning. So I I could. Uh, start learning, you know, like a, a field where men has dominated, you find that in the, uh, most of the riders are men, mm -hmm. you find that I want to know the CC, I want mm -hmm. to know the horsepower, I'm curious uh -huh. to know mm -hmm. if a client comes for the first service, uh -huh. what is it that is changed, is it a filter, uh -huh. is it, I need to know so that uh -huh. in a perspective where they see I'm a woman, I'm uh -huh. able to say, tell them, look, I know the filter is this much. Uh -huh. We love to change the filter, the engine oil, and all. I love the fact that you brought up the. You pointed out another fact right. that you're a woman <laughs> in an industry dominated by it's, men. It's uh, questions pertaining to sex, I'll hold them to, uh, for towards the end. Uh, I'd like to know what did it take you to get to this particular point? What did you have to do? Let's start with your primary school. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. um, uh, Right from our age four four system, mm -hmm. changed by now. Mm -hmm. I'll say uh, education is is a pillar. Uh -huh. But now getting from the school and also going uh, uh, through my um, university level. Mm -hmm. Once you come from the school, to be honest, uh, you don't have the application the job level. Mm -hmm. So my job training, uh, mm -hmm. in job training is a management training. That's when I learned that. I have this passion of maybe uh, not only following on my JD, mm -hmm. I'll go out of my way and get to know something else different. Mm -hmm. If given just to do customer inquiries, mm -hmm. I'm the person who do the follow-ups a week mm -hmm. before the boss comes, I've already done the follow-ups. Mm -hmm. So you find, hide this interesting. Initiative. Correct. <laughs> yes, All right. Yes. So uh, you studied uh, bachelor. Uh, you studied commerce in campus. Yes, I've done uh, uh -huh. uh, a bachelor of commerce marketing option, mm -hmm. and on my MBA, specialize in strategic management. Strategic management. Yes. All right. So uh, uh, between you uh, uh, attaining your degree or studying bachelors of commerce and uh, going in for the master's degree program. Uh, Nini li fanyika pa kati kati? You were working? Were you working? Or yes, you went I remember. In I remember we. Uh, I applied for Barclays, uh -huh. uh, now Hapsa, which uh -huh. is uh, Hapsa. I uh, applied for just a normal uh, direct representative mm -hmm. sales agent to so uh -huh. go and create accounts for customers. Uh -huh. So, uh, but I didn't stay there for long. Just wanted to understand what is it that. Uh, from my initial, um, uh, I'll say, uh, 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 beginning uh -huh. on the job career, I just wanted to involve myself in the sales process. Mm -hmm. So you could go prospecting, mm -hmm. just the normal prospecting. Do are you you qualify? Are you banking with any bank? Mm -hmm. So my work was creation of accounts. I worked mm -hmm. for Barclays. Also moved to consumer mm -hmm. uh, business that was in Stanford. Then now I w I joined Kind Gentle as a management trainer. I was right. trying to find myself. You were trying to find yourself. Yes. All right. Uh, I'd like to take you back to when you were in campus, uh, specializing in marketing, and right now uh, working at uh, uh, Kanjan Ro. Mm -hmm. uh, what are some of the things that have changed when it comes to marketing? Marketing has evolved, obviously. What are some of the things that surprise you uh, in marketing right now that didn't exist when you were doing your final year in uh, in the University of Nairobi? Um, uh, today's customer is tech serve. Mm -hmm. That means, even for us as um, marketers and mm -hmm. people who are uh, I mean, given the responsibility to sell these products, mm -hmm. you need to be aware of the dynamics in the market. For mm -hmm. example, I'll give you uh, an example of a customer who works in the showroom. Mm -hmm. A normal border border today, we refer mm -hmm. them to as just a border border, but this is a client who is, because of the digital era that we're living in, mm -hmm is using the application, mm -hmm. he's an Uber. Mm -hmm. If you want to get a safe border, you have to use the application. Mm -hmm. So us as marketers, what we're trying to do is become innovative. Again, I'll mention innovation is one of our key values, mm -hmm. whereby we come up with products that match the trends in the market, mm -hmm. understanding the customer journey, because digital era is here to stay. Mm -hmm. So we find that most of our, our I'll say the border border bikes, the mm -hmm. HLX series, mm -hmm. now we have it with the charging port. Mm -hmm so that you don't uh, lose power and you are, I mean you are using the application all day to get your client mm -hmm. to get your next ride mm -hmm. so you don't lose power so we are putting the charging port on these um, uh, units mm -hmm. and also you have the uh, fuel gauge mm -hmm. together 
So we have to move the terms of uh, uh, the just journey with the customer. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, uh, technology is here. So even the products, even mm -hmm. us as marketers, mm -hmm. you need to sharpen this. So I'll, I'll say uh, you need to equate yourself with what is happening in the environment so mm -hmm. that you'll be at par with the client. All right. Yes. Thank you very much. And uh, I'm glad today I have, uh, uh, I have a guest who's... Uh, part of the system, part of uh, corporate Nairobi, corporate Kenya, corporate Africa. And uh, I had a conversation with, uh, with a lady who's so passionate uh, about the feminist movement. Mm. And uh, she was telling me uh, the corporate Africa, corporate Nairobi does not love women. It does not provide the same opportunities for women. And I, I was of the idea that uh, at the moment you start uh, discriminating people, uh, uh, discriminating against people on any other aspect apart from what's <laughs> in their heads, you're bound to feel. That is, uh, that is like signing your death, uh, your death warrant uh, as a corporate. What, am I right or is she right? Uh, to some extent, uh, I'll say it's right because uh -huh. we have the perception that in the corporate world, mm -hmm. 100% uh, of the senior level management mm -hmm. must be men. Mm -hmm. But I'm seeing uh, the role of women have uh, shifted mm -hmm. of recently. Mm -hmm. uh, if you check around even our Kenyan, um, uh, in, in a Kenyan uh, perspective, uh -huh. in the career uh, industries, we have um, um, Tabida Karanja with the CEO. Mm -hmm. That tells you a woman can lead. Mm -hmm. Check even the energy sector. We mm -hmm. have uh, Kenyan, we have Rebecca mm -hmm. Miano who is leading. The cabinet is... Uh, <laughs> that means that... Uh, it has is actually in the mind. Uh -huh. It's doable. It's doable. So what I encourage young women out there uh -huh. is just um, uh, whatever you're given to do. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll say one thing. Uh, mm -hmm. Make uh, there's a, a writer who says mm -hmm. John Wooden mentioned that make each day your masterpiece. All right. Wake up every day knowing that uh, well, my I'm not a woman. We're mm -hmm. just being given the same responsibilities. At the end mm -hmm. of the day. We need to meet the same target. So you're you, male or female. You're telling me uh, that you're telling me that uh, women have opportunities out here. Opportunities are there. It has to keep constantly looking for them. Keep looking for them. Correct. Wonderful. Mm. All right. Uh, what to all the queens who are watching right now? <laughs> There's opportunities uh, for women in the corporate world, in Nairobi and in Africa as well. Yes. All right. Uh, so something that people uh, don't really know about you is that uh, when you're not uh, doing, uh, when you're not working with consumers or customers, uh, you like to farm on the side. Uh, yes, true. Uh -huh. um, I do a side as well, I call uh -huh. it so. Uh -huh. uh, we do pig farming. Mm -hmm. We have a small um, uh, ranch in Konza uh -huh. where we, pu we put a, a small uh, uh, kind of a pig business. Mm -hmm. A population of uh, 40 mm -hmm. just began. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, so fast. You seem went. to be working with some partners there? Uh, you have a farm manager on site. Uh -huh. And basically on pigs, not really, once you get the expenses correct uh -huh. and you have the farm manager in control of the uh -huh. vaccination, especially the first 21 days, mm -hmm. it's not a uh, whole, well, uh, and then you have a, uh, I mean, a supply in terms of feeds mm -hmm. and there's constant water supply. That what is the uh, market value of a fully grown pig? <laughs> uh, interesting. On, uh, on supplies like Farmer's Choice, uh -huh. they, they'll come for... Uh, the young ones, then uh -huh. the, the, those are the ones that are meant for uh, slaughter. Uh -huh. That is between from six months. Uh -huh. the, the, they are the ones that uh, they come for slaughter on the seam. Mm -hmm. So for that, that is what um, makes our bacon and smokies and so <laughs> Interesting. And they, uh -huh. they grade them. They uh -huh. grade one, grade two. There's pigs for export. There's, uh -huh. there's so much pork for export. The uh -huh. ones that has, has to be used and thrown away. Uh -huh. So you can't do it on your own because uh -huh. you don't have the facilities. But uh -huh. I would say it's an interesting venture to come up with. Uh -huh. And uh, uh, price base is around fifteen thousand. All right. Yeah. Wow. Lovely. That's good money. I'm mm. thinking of getting into that as well. <laughs> All right. The reason I bring this up is because uh, not so many people of your generation, Kukuja uh, Shini, uh, let's let me say our generation going down, uh, would think about investing in farming, especially the ladies, because. Uh, uh, the glam, the obsession with glam now is 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 is, uh, is skyrocketing. Mm -hmm. So I'd I'd like to know what would you what would you tell uh, some of the youth out there about this farming uh, thing? 
Uh, basically, many people are waiting to be employed. Mm -hmm. One, if you get the chance to be employed, give it your best. Mm -hmm. If you can, um, uh, you can get a way to grow in any opportunity that you get, please mm -hmm. give it your best. If not, uh, try to venture out. Uh, mm -hmm. Entrepreneurs are making it out there. Mm -hmm. uh, farming, farming. There's a lot of opportunity in terms of you can do pig farming, you can do pottery. Mm -hmm. You've seen guys uh, excel mm -hmm. pottery, for example. Mm -hmm. You can even venture in farming. Uh, um, I have a partner. Growing wheat. plants. Yeah, uh -huh. you can grow the plants, but uh -huh. start Greenhouse. small. Start uh -huh. small. Start uh -huh. small. Don't a dream start small. Uh -huh. You know, start half a year. You've not gotten the experience uh -huh. and uh -huh. expenses on earning. Just as to, to to run a simple kind mm -hmm. of a business. Start uh -huh. small. And uh, how, and what would you uh, tell people who are employed? And that is the only source of income they have. Um, my thinking is different. Mm -hmm. You need to diversify. Mm -hmm. um, again, uh, if you diversify, means that uh, today you've seen so many uh, because of a distressed kind of an economy. Mm -hmm. Companies are laying off. Uh, mm -hmm. So assume that job is not uh, there today, mm -hmm. and then tomorrow, what next, uh, for, what next for you? So, mm -hmm. so that uh, should always be the thinking. Have option number two. Mm -hmm. so always have <laughs> option number two. So always have a second option. Correct. All right. Yes. I feel that. So how can they find you on social media? And uh, how can they get a hold of your services as well? All right. Uh, mm -hmm. I'll say that um, I, uh, my Facebook page is um, Carol Sam. Mm -hmm. Fo uh, follow me on my Facebook page is Carol Sam. Mm -hmm. Um, as, as mentioned at the beginning, work for mm -hmm. Can General, come mm -hmm. in, pop in, have a look on our products, right from consumer products up to equipment business, mm -hmm. including um, the after sales, that's the MRF, the lubricants, and all, mm -hmm. and all that, yes. Including the after sales? Yes. So you, you cover people, <laughs> <laughs> killer, killer part? <laughs> we do, we take care of what we sell in terms uh -huh. of spare parts and, uh -huh. and the service. All right. Yes. Do you have hobbies, by the way? Because you <laughs> seem to be working so hard when you're not uh, working with the consumers or working with the customers I do. or doing your customer service uh, thing. Uh, you are farming. What is this thing that you love to uh, that gets your mind off things? At times, um, I love football. Uh -huh. Contrary to what many wow. ladies do, <laughs> we lost please, last night to Bayern. <laughs> oh my! I know the team. I know the team. I'm sorry for you. I'm sorry for you. It's fine. It's so, fine. So football is one of them. True. Uh, what other thing gets your mind off? This? Sorry. What What other thing gets your mind off? Uh, a crazy day at work. Uh, uh, when I'm I'm not at work. Yeah, what gets your mind off a great mini kama football? Are you, uh, something you do for leisure? Oh, for leisure. Uh -huh. At times I travel much. Mm -hmm. I love networking. Our mm -hmm. nature of job is really have to connect so many mm -hmm. clients, networking, and mm -hmm. meeting new people. Mm -hmm. That is it. I have to right. be outgoing. Thank you very much for sharing. Thank you very much Thank for you. coming. Thank and uh, we appreciate you so much. I appreciate uh, too. Your last remarks uh, to the queens who are watching you right now because I'm pretty sure they're inspired by the strength. Thank you. you. Um, uh. Mine is to encourage you. Um, don't look yourself as a junior person. Mm -hmm. Anything is possible. Mm -hmm. Actually, the sky is not the limit. Mm -hmm. Get out there. Uh, we mentioned that make every day a masterpiece. Mm -hmm. Do something that is out of your way. If a JD is and tells this, just become proactive. Mm -hmm. Our purpose, put in commitment and some discipline. Mm -hmm. And the results will be amazing. Commitment, discipline, initiative. Correct. Commitment, discipline, initiative. Mm -hmm. Three key words. Thank you very much, Ms. Carol. Thank you very we much. We appreciate you. Yes, we have come to the end of Strength of a Woman for today. And I hope you guys have learned yourself something. Kalami Vala is something special for you as well. Up Coming up next, it's, uh, it's Girls Talk. It's a hot topic. You don't want to miss it. And the question is on Facebook. Remember, Facebook is at White54. Uh, Twitter is White54 uh, channel. Instagram is White54 underscore channel. You can hit me up at It's Very More. Or you can... Hit up at Kalami Val. So uh, don't touch that dial. Enjoy some music. Then we'll be back with Girlstone.